In a shocking turn of events, Prince Andrew, the disgraced member of the UK royal family, managed to sneak into the official coronation portraits donning his formal garter robes. However, sources suggest that these controversial photographs are highly unlikely to see the light of day. The 63-year-old prince, who has faced severe criticism and public scrutiny due to his association with the late convicted sex offender Jeffrey Epstein, raised eyebrows when he decided to wear the velvet robes during his brother's coronation. Despite his diminished role as a senior royal and being stripped of his official duties, Andrew reportedly insisted on being part of the prestigious photo shoot captured by Hugo Bernand. According to an insider quoted by The Telegraph, Prince Andrew actively sought inclusion in the portraits and made special requests for the photo session to accommodate him. The source revealed, Andrew wanted to be included in the photo shoot and requested that there would be time in the schedule for him to be photographed. The insider further explained that the disgraced Duke wanted an official record of his participation in his brother's coronation, emphasizing the significance of the event. However, it seems unlikely that the palace will release these contentious images to the public. Both the palace and Hugo Bernand, the photographer responsible for the portraits, declined to comment on the matter, fueling speculation surrounding the decision. Initial assumptions were that Andrew had been deliberately excluded from the photo shoot to reflect his diminished status as a non-working royal, stripped of his titles. None of the previously released portraits featured the controversial prince, including group photos of working members of the royal family. In a surprising twist, Prince Harry, King Charles's estranged son, was also absent from the portraits. He swiftly departed the coronation to return to his family in exile in California, opting for a simple morning suit instead of the garter robes worn by his uncle. Speculations arose as to whether Harry's attire would mirror his uncle's, but he chose a different path altogether. King Charles grants controversial honor, brother's refusal to move set stage for palace battle. It is worth noting that King Charles granted his brother special permission to wear the robes adorned with the badge of the Order of the Garter, one of the oldest and most prestigious orders of knighthood. This honour bestowed upon Andrew contradicts reports suggesting that he still refuses to vacate his opulent $37 million residence at the Royal Lodge in Windsor. It's been previously reported that King Charles's frustration with his brother's refusal to comply with orders to relocate to the smaller Frogmore Cottage, previously occupied by Harry and his family, before their departure from the country. The situation remains unchanged, and there are rumours that the royal family might even consider cutting off utilities to force Andrew's relocation, according to a friend of Harry's quoted by the Mail on Sunday. The friend expressed concerns about potential repercussions following the coronation, stating, He's concerned that now the coronation is over, the knives are out, but we're dealing with human beings, not real estate. This ongoing dispute between the brothers has resulted in Andrew becoming increasingly reclusive, according to a close associate. As the public eagerly awaits further updates from the royal family, it seems that Prince Andrew's participation in the official coronation portraits will remain shrouded in secrecy, adding yet another chapter to his controversial and troubled legacy.